Right now, Dr. Alfred Bonatti and the Bonatti Spine Institute have filed a $500 million federal lawsuit against the Florida Agency for Healthcare Administration, or AHCA, after the agency closed down his facility for four months last year. The lawsuit, which also names state employees, alleges civil rights violations, conspiracy by state officials, defamation, and libel. The complaint involves the emergency closure of the Bonatti Spine Institute last year based on allegations that a certified surgical technologist performed an entire spine surgery. The, compl the complaint alleges those allegations were known to be false and the closure was done in a deliberate effort to damage the facility and the reputation of the owner, Dr. Alfred Bonatti. They allege the four month closure of the business cost millions of dollars. We're nearly a year later, and we continue to feel the devastating effects that this deliberate and intentional action of our government agency has caused us. While the damage continues to mount, we are finally in a position to start our own litigation against ACA and anyone else we found that participated in this official act of our state's government. Well, the I-Team reported last year about the closure and Dr. Bonatti's history of malpractice, settlements, and disciplinary actions by the Florida Board of Medicine. And Dr. Bonatti declined an on-camera interview at the time and again yesterday.